Hello everyone, in this video we're going to make an overview on the contest costume. So basically these customs were made by the first place winners from each region and there are 4 sets customs on it. So first we're going to take a look at the first custom that I got for free. So this custom is made by the Counter Strike Nexon Studio players and he made a pirate set custom which looks pretty fit for Transcendence Michela. So first I'm going to take a look at the pirate head first. So as you can see there's a Counter Strike logo on it but the color scheme kinda reminds me of the season pass medal and it also looks similar into her outfit, and if we take a look up here, I can see her twin tail came out from her pirate head. Yeah, maybe it's because of the gold source engine, that's why it's kinda look unrealistic. But at least he's done a better job for making this pirate head. And next, we've got the dual cutlass. So basically, this is the pirate weapon. Yeah, just a normal pirate weapon, but it's just a custom prop. I wish next time made a season pass where pirate was the main team and the cutlass became a usable weapon instead of just becoming a custom prop but at least it's pretty good yeah, it's kind of pretty good for Michela and the last one was the treasure box yeah as you can see this treasure box was kind of open and it has a tons of golds on it and they also add a necklace on the treasure box but I think it looks kind of pretty blank I think next second she'll add some jewelry like gems or anything else on that treasure box instead of just adding a Netflix but at least it's a great custom so I'm gonna rate this custom 8 out of 10 because this custom looks pretty badass for Transcendence Michela and now let's move on to the second custom next we've got the Fox custom which was made by the Curse Strike Online Taiwan and Hong Kong player originally I was about to use this custom on Skadi but since I don't even have Skadi due to my worst luck when opening a decoder I'm going to use this custom on Sonya Lycanthrope instead and I've just turned her into a fury. So first let me take a look at the fox ear on her head. So this fox ear was kinda realistic because it's kinda animated and since I'm using this custom on Sonya, I've just gave her two extra ears. The next one was the fox tail. Yeah, so it's a nine fox tail on Sonya back but when I attempt to move this character it's not even animated and it's just a static object. Maybe it's because of the limitation issue again. That's why Nexon decided to make this tail as a static object instead of an animated object. The last one was the fox pet. So it's just a flying fox pet and she just turned around and she can also lick her finger. Yeah, look at that. Yeah, it looks pretty cute though. And But since I'm using Sonya, it doesn't even fit. So I'm just gonna give this custom 8 out of 10 again because this custom was animated. And now let's move on to the third costume. Next, we've got the Wanderer costume which was made by the Curse Strike Online China player. Originally, I was about to use this custom on Lin but I don't have to explain it anymore. So I'm just using this custom on Mei instead. And let's take a look at the Wanderer's head first. If we take a look at this head, there's a twin dragon on the top of the head and there's also a veil surrounding the backside of this head and this head kinda reminds me of Wanderer aka Scaramouche from Genshin Impact. Next there's a flying dragon around Mei and it's just a blue dragon. It's just a normal pet dragon but I really like this dragon because this dragon looks kinda realistic and it serves as the best companion for my characters. And the last one it's just a bottle on, on her tykes and I don't have much to say about it. It's just an ordinary costume and I could say that this is my personal favorite costume because it has the best looking costume ever made by the China player. So I'm gonna rate this costume 10 out of 10 be because i am always used this costume on my Asian Ritsuka to make it look pretty cool although the color doesn't even fit for Asian Ritsuka. And now let's move on to the last costume. Lastly, we have the Wild Sheriff costume which was made by the Counter Strike Online Korea player. So as you can see, it's just a horse costume for Dominic and as you can see, this is the worst looking costume ever because it's just a fake little horse that serves as the costume and if I attempt to crouch, look at this thing. His back feet is not even touch the ground and look, look at his hand. His hand just passed through the one of the horse eye and it looks pretty bad and the horse face is also pretty ugly although the sheriff hat and the sheriff badge on his back looks pretty decent but I don't even accept this custom because originally some Korea players just see this custom as a joke and 
they decided to vote this custom that's why this custom became the first place winner for korean player and i don't really like this custom because this custom was a disappointment for a lot of players including me so i'm gonna rate this custom 3 out of 10 because this custom is full of joke and pretty ugly sorry korean players for rating this custom as the worst custom ever and now let's move on to the summary after i made a review on these customs i will give the wanderer custom on the first place because it's the best looking custom ever yay and on the second place i'm gonna give the pirate custom because it looks pretty badass and the third place i'm gonna give it to the fox custom and the fourth place eh, you already know about it the wild sheriff custom aka the ugliest custom ever yeah i really hate that custom but i hope Nexon made another contest which another player can also participate to make a custom but I hope they don't even make any joke custom like that horse custom. Alright everyone, thank you for watching this video. If you wanna play with me, just simply add my Steam account and you can also join my Discord server by clicking the link in the description. If you wanna show your support, just click the link in the description too. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. See you in the next video. Bye bye!